Namaste again. <laughs> it's me, Namaste away. All right, so this is the third video I'm doing today. Okay, am I done? Uh, I don't think so. Okay, I want to say real quick because I am hungry. I don't have anything to drink in the car. I don't have anything to eat in the car, but I did do a walk and talk for 30 minutes. I walked for 30, maybe 33 or 34 minutes. So give myself, but we could round it to 30, 30 minutes that I walked in the freezing cold. But I'm not going to upload that until after you see this because, um, this is the second Pisces thing, and I want and a little bit of Scorpio um, that I wanted to get out. I wanted to get out, and I don't have my cards. I well, I do have my cards. There's always cards with me. Actually, I got to change my spot. You know why? Because I see a creepy guy. <laughs> Not that he's that creepy, but um, I want to give a shout out. <sighs> yeah, I just. I have to always change my spot if I really don't feel secure about where I am. So I'm just going to be out in the open over here. Hopefully they don't call the cops on me for just being parked here. Because that guy was going into his van, and I don't like to be near the van. Right? Yeah. Well, the only place they don't really bother me is Walmart. But I want to give a shout out to my beautiful soul sisters. These two soul sisters, I love, I have a lot of soul sisters, okay? I want to, um, I gave a shout out in my walking video, but I want to give another shout out to my beautiful real sister, my real, like, biological sister, <laughs> who's an Aries. Her name is Karen. She's a nurse. She lives in New Jersey. Whoop, 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 formerly of Staten Island, New York. Yeah, in Staten Island. That's not really a Staten Island thing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. All right, let's get the coat off. And here's a little preview. Yin Yang. Can you see the Yin Yang? Can you guys see the Yin Yang? Okay. Yin Yang. And look at the sleeves, right? And then in the mail, I got this from my soul sister. My, oh, look at this, right? Oh, oh, <laughs> and I showed you in my other video, my toenails, my toenails, only the big toe, the big toes on each foot, of course. <laughs> um, oh, I love this. Did you kiss this crystal medicine? Crystal, did you kiss this before you sent it off to me? She makes, she made this. She makes little mermaids and mermen and jewelry. I mean, you knew that she sold jewelry and does things with crystals and stuff, of course. But anyhow, who's that? Thank you for subbing? What? Wait. Thanks again for subbing for me. Will you be... Huh. Sorry. I hope you guys didn't see that. That's all my texts. Okay. I can't talk to her right now. Okay. I'm on a video. So I want to thank Crystal Medicine. But first, let me say a shout out prayers up for my sister, Karen. She's a nurse in New Jersey. Um, and she, you know, had a procedure done. And she has to go back and get another procedure done. So please, prayer is up. She just got, she has macular degeneration in her eyes. She had one operation. She has to get the other eye done. Um, that's pretty good, I think. But she's getting uh, operation on a kidney, sacral chakra, orange sacral chakra. She knows about it. But please, prayers up for Karen Brady. Karen Brady, please. Karen Brady Rispoli. Yeah, I said your name. And there's nothing wrong with that. Okay. Yes. So thank you guys, because prayers always work. So I'm sending a prayer out for my Aries sister, Karen Brady, Karen Brady Rispoli. Um, I love you, and I'm praying for you, and I'm lighting my candle tonight for you. 
and I want all my subs. And what I said in my earlier video is that I thought that um, 88% or 85% of the sub of people subscribed. No, it's only 70. It's only 70. So people, please subscribe. But it doesn't even matter. I'm so over it. I am over it. It doesn't even matter. I'm just going to do whatever the F I want to do. I'm sorry that I said the letter F, but it's still not a curse. I could say frig. Okay? I like to say friggy frig. Anyhow, let's push this back. So, my, uh, um, all right, so my two soul sisters, and also, thank you, Kath. Kath Rispoli out there, um, thank you so much for the sage who came in the mail today at the house. Um, thank you so much for the, she sent me white sage, it's in the house. I'm, I might be bringing it into the car, um, one of the bottles, but the other bottle, it's because Devin can't stand that smell, so I could at least spray the area so that the, the, um, any bad energy that's left over from the readings will mischievous energy will disappear and so thank you Kath thank you Ruby Ruby another soul sister this was, is this Christmas is it my birthday <laughs> I know I'm being obnoxious but that's me all right let me put the, my heat on too okay oh, just, just thinking of something okay so this is from crystal and amethyst is on his way on monday i will put him in the mail i will go to the post office where i live at okay put him in the mail all right so she gave me root support in addition to this that i want to pay you for you got to get your yang on your yang on your yin and your yang okay um, this is for root chakra. At first, I thought it was bubble bath, and then I looked at it closer with my blonde eyes, and um, I just said my blonde eyes, <laughs> my blind eyes, and it, I found out it was tea. And thank you so much. I need this. I didn't know you sold this. All right. Oh, uh, it's too small for me to see with my blind eyes. Okay. I'm loving this yin and yang shirt. It was in the boy section. You get all the cool shirts in the boy section. And then, of course, I butchered the neck. Just so that it wasn't choking me. I might even take off the whole neck. But sometimes I just go like this. And I just go, shh, whoop. So then I can fold it down. And you can still see the Chinese writing, whatever it says. It probably says, I am an asshole. Whoever wears this shirt is an asshole. <laughs> We'll never know. Okay, anybody read Chinese? Okay. Anybody understand yin and yang? Okay, so. Thank you so much for this. It came in this beautiful little packet. Thank you for the tea. Thank you for the beautiful cards that you, I know you make. I'm pretty sure you make them, these cards. Do you make these? Do you have like a new stamping system? Look at this. I love that. I friggin' love it. Look at this. Shine bright. Shine bright like Shanann. Shine bright. This nail is broken. <laughs> I'm not trying to give you the finger, but this nail is, I always have trouble with. Um, but the rest of them are pretty good, being that I use them so severely with my artwork, glue and paint. Okay, look at this. She gave me donut. I could use all these things. And in the in your regular card, you gave me a lot of cool stuff. Good vibes. I always wear shirts that say good vibes. But yet, I still manage to have some bad vibes. But that's always yin and the yang. Okay. Just got to keep it moving. Thank you so much, sweetie. And... She gave me, that is not all. Oh no, that is not all. Okay. And then I'll do, I'll, sh I'll do Ruby. Then I'll do the Pisces. Then I got to get home to make dinner. I don't really feel like making the eggplant, but I have to try to be nice and make the broccoli. Maybe I'll bake the broccoli. Yeah. Uh, okay. We'll do it. tea tree oil. 
I needed that. How did you know? Crystal medicine. And um, this is essential oils, which I had asked you for. Thank you so much. I, these babies work. Oh. oh, I'll be free base in that. You know that. Whatever that means. I'm still not smelling. I'm still not able to smell 100%. Tastes pretty, pretty okay. This, this is always an excuse to eat. And then this is a aromatherapy candle. Oh, which is lavender, my favorite. Thank you so much. Let me give you a hug. Awkward. <laughs> okay. Thank you. And she gave me other stuff that I'm not showing you. Uh, yeah. And thank you for the payment for Amethyst. I, I appreciate it, but I really want to pay you for this. <laughs> it's three levels of yin-yang. This, the necklace, and the shirt. Yeah, get your yin and your yang on. Yes, I am crazy. Uh, almost every day people ask me, are you drinking? Okay, but I'm not. I'm not. Back in, the, I was watching a, a video, old video of myself when I was up all night and I had a nine o'clock appointment at the hair place. So it was a Friday night, I guess, into Saturday. And I had, I was conditioning my hair because I guess I was getting it, uh, I was going to get highlights put in it. I don't think I ever made it because I think I only got my highlights done twice in three years, two years. Three years? I don't know. Who knows? Um, and thank you so much for this. This is bath salts. Did I say I, I'm going to be taking this to the hotel? Whatever hotel I go to. Oh, so healing. I didn't know. Do you make these? Because it says it's handmade. Yes, you do make these. That's right. Oh, thank you so much, girl. Okay. So that's a namaste to Crystal Medicine. If you're not subbed up to her, get over there, okay? <laughs> get over there after you watch my video. Um, or it doesn't matter. I don't care anymore. I really don't. I just want to do deliver these messages. And I am happy and grateful for all the love that people have shown me, all the generosity that people have shown me, all the friends that I've made. I am happy and grateful for them and that's it i'm not even pushing for the four thousand anymore um but you know i will give away those prizes <laughs> the four prizes that i told that i spoke about and there was something else that they were telling me to do they were telling me um this this was just this was just in um recently last night i think when i, w I couldn't fall asleep um they want me to do spirit messages videos. All right, so messages from spirit for the collective using my heaven cards, my different heaven cards, the ones that I made the one and the two different decks that I had bought. That one deck I have probably since 1990. Or it could be even in the 80s. 1989? That's a long time. Yeah. It's over 30 years. Anyway, anyway, what they told me to do is for the collective, people need to hear from their spirit, from their loved ones. And they want me to meditate first, of course. Duh. Have the music very, very no interruptions they don't want me to be interrupted so that means pool room i have to go to the pool room okay all right so what's that what's that you'll find out when it's time yeah because when i was looking at this card hello from heaven it says, hello from heaven, Archangel Azrael, your loved ones in heaven are doing fine. Let go of worries and feel their blessings. 
feel their loving blessings. So they, they, and then they were like, this, I know I used to do things for the collective. There's so many things I want to do, but I'm, I'm about to get really busy at my job. I'm busy with my artwork. I'm busy with readings, but I'm about to get very busy at my job. When I say very busy, I mean working every day. You know what happens to me when I work even just one day? I usually don't come on because I'm so tired. <laughs> I'm so tired. Um, so I don't have any energy for anything else. Um, yeah, that's why that bathroom has to get cleaned before March. Okay. And somebody asked me, one, I think it was Bayo, said, are you working next week and what days are you working? But I don't know. I have my, my address book at home. I don't even have my wallet with me because I just went for a walk and then I decided to go to the post office um, to pick up the two packages. Now, I am so sorry, Ruby, Ruby, Ruby. P please, prayers up for Ruby because she has an ear infection and a throat infection. So she's on antibiotics, but she's still pushing herself to go to work. And I told her, stay home. Anyway, prayers up for our girl, Ruby, who's also an Aries. What's up with Aries? Aries, you guys have to think positive thoughts. And you know, you know this, Ruby, because you're a reader, you're a light worker, you're an empath. Um, manifest. What we, manif what we think in our mind, we manifest. So don't just say, oh, okay, it's going to get worse and worse. No, just say, I'm so happy and grateful now that I'm healing. I'm so happy and grateful now that I'm staying home from work to heal my body and rest my body. Okay. You could still do videos if you want. Okay. I'm not going to, I'm not going to be like other people to me. They're always like, now just rest and don't do any videos. Don't tell me that because then what am I going to want to do? Because I'm immature. I'm not mature. Okay. Sometimes in my mind, I'm still eight years old. Other times I'm 22. Okay. Other times uh, I'm stuck at 33. All right. I uh, didn't like the 40s. So I'm never in the 40s. I like the 50s better. I'm still in the 50s. All right. I liked 52. I like turning 50. I like 52. I didn't mind. I, I looked forward to 55 because I knew then I could retire. Uh, did, I, did I retire? <laughs> Is this retiring? Um, yeah, semi. Um, but no, I knew then I would be working as a teacher from age 17 to 55. So I always looked forward to 50, 55. And um, that's when people used to get their retirement parties and stuff like that. But I, I told you guys, Devin gave me my retirement party. Um, anyhow, I'm still working. So I'm sorry, I'm immature. <laughs> that was my point. So Ruby, 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 will you love me? Ruby, 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 will you care? Okay, I know that was awkward, but I'm going to do a surprise. Ruby, thank you for your presence. Let me see if you could hear me. Can you hear me? How about now? Can everybody hear me? <laughs> she got me a microphone! This is what I wanted. I saw people with this and I was like, oh my gosh, I so want that friggin' thing. I want that friggin' microphone. Thank you so much. That's, I'm gonna cry. Don't make me cry. I gotta still do Pisces. Okay. So what's my phone on? So Ruby, thank you so much. That's Ana, Ama, stay here. Stay here in my soul circle. And she gave us Palo Santo up in this biatch because she knew I needed it. Let's get it going. Let's get it going. <laughs> Let's use red this time. Let's use red. This is a fresh Palo Santo up in this biatch. And I just told, um, could you hear me? Am I too loud? People are going to be like, Ruby, you had to give her that. You freaking had to give her that. I really love it. I, tr I tested it out. I tested, not the Palo Santo. 
Um, I love the Palo Santo too, but I tested out the microphone because I couldn't believe that my Samsung 7, my old fashioned phone would actually adopt to something normal. Let me turn off the heat. Okay, so this is, this burn is to thank my soul sisters and to pray for my sister, my biological sister, um, and also Ruby and anybody else and Tammy. I want prayers up for Tammy at all times. You know, Tammy, she's going for, she went for her chemo consult. And um, we just got to keep the prayers going. I have the candles going. Um, we want everybody to be safe. I'm thinking of my white dove, Stephanie. She lives in Arkansas and she said it's very snowy and slippery. I had a vision of her hurting and bruising her arm. And then I woke up with this bruise. Look at this bruise I woke up with. No, Devin's not beating me up. Um, this is from a little old Casper. Yeah, Casper Spirit. He, my dog, my puppy, he did that to me because he beats me up when he jumps on me. Um, but anyway, I saw that vision and I called, uh, sorry about my fat arms. Um, I called, I texted uh, Stephanie and I said, did you fall on the ice? and bruise your arm and your wrist. And she said, no, but I did fall in the back of the house when I was feeding the birds, um, but I, I was just a little achy. So I said, please don't go out. If you, if you can help it, don't go out. See, that went out fast. So this is for all my soul sisters, all the people that watch me, that even don't watch me, all the people that um, need healing prayers and um, but if you watch me, you're at an advantage because you can do the Palo Santo up in this biatch with me. And my car's name is Midnight Buddha. I know it's a weird name, but my other truck's name was Sapphire. And why am I telling you that? I don't know. Because I'm a weirdo. Okay. Just one more time. Okay. We're going to do it old-fashioned. Is this thing okay 22 minutes in and I didn't even start all right it's okay because I had a lot of things to say it's not gonna be long I'm gonna strictly read the notes yeah let's see if that happens okay let's take it old-fashioned deep breath in hold it for five Let it out in five spurts. One, two, three, four. And on the fifth one, empty your lungs. <sighs> now we're just going to take a deep breath and hold it for five again. empty. One more time. Think of something happy. Empty. Can you hear me? Now I can sing to you. Would you like me to sing to you? Everybody's saying no. <laughs> okay, but thank you, Ruby, that you did not have to do that. Thank you, uh, Crystal Medicine, you did not have to do that either. And I thank you guys, and thank you, Kath, for the spray. And thank you, everybody who's watching, and give me comments, and give me a, a thumbs up or a thumbs down, um, or whatever you're doing to put forward a happy thought for me. And I appreciate that. And I appreciate when I do prayers up for somebody, I appreciate that you just even think for a few seconds and you say that person's name, like Karen Brady Rispoli, or you say um, Tammy's name and you think, uh, you know, healing energy. And that sends out vibes to the universe. You don't see it. It's invisible. But it's a thought, even if it's, and if you go and friggin' light up a Palo Santo and think of somebody, that, that goes 
this is going to have Karen's name on it. Um, that goes even further. And if you light a friggin' candle, it's candles are powerful. That I have candles all over the place. And you might say, hey, but your candles, you know, with Summer's name on it, Michael's name on it, Lena's name on it, Sincere and Classic's name on it, Suzanne's name on it, we haven't found them. But you know what? Every time I light it and I think a thought, I act as if it happened. I act as if we got closer to it. And you know what? Maya, her husband's in jail, okay? And he's staying in there, unlike Barry, because he doesn't have the greenery. All right. And they didn't find her body yet, but they will. They'll find something. They'll find some kind of evidence. And P.S. You don't have to have the body all the time. People have been convicted without bodies found. OK, put that in your pipe and smoke it. All right. People who are murderers out there. We're coming for you. All right. Thank you. Say thank you. I'm such a weirdo. All right. I read one page out of the Pisces. So now watch this. Watch how good I get. Can you hear me? Do I need to talk into the microphone like this? Okay. Anyway, thank you for the microphone and the Palo Santo and everything, guys. <laughs> and this, there's all different, um, there's all different containers. Well, I can't find it in this dump. It's somewhere. It's somewhere. Uh, like different, I could put different colors on it. Um, okay, so I think I read this one. Toxic. Somebody's top. This, now let's get back to Pisces. Pisces Paradise. Pisces, male and female, um, masculine divine, and feminine divine. Maybe you're married to a Pisces. Maybe you have a friend as a Pisces. Maybe you have a sibling as a Pisces. I have a sister and a brother, Pisces. Okay, so toxic. Somebody wants to marry you one day, but they were toxic. They're toxic for you. Um, but they say, I'm going to marry you one day. Uh, and you're like, well, if you improve on what makes you toxic, then we, we could do business. But if you don't improve on it, I'm going to put my heat on, back on. If you don't improve on it, then um, we can't do business. Business business. Okay. Failed attempt at trying to be cool. They want to come back, but they need to come back correct. I think I said that. Um, but are they different? You're not different. So maybe they're not different either. Okay. Um, okay. This one's a hot mess. So let me try. All right. Release and receive the blessings, Pisces. Release anything from the past and get ready to receive the blessings that are coming in. Have patience. You're too restless. Um, I am like that too. I must have something in Pisces moon, Pisces, uh, Venus or something. Um, but have patience. The spirit guides are letting you know you are going to get what you're trying to manifest, write it down, visualize it happening, visualize it, act as if it already happened and bring it into your universe but don't be like so restless that oh it didn't happen in by march uh 2022 so i'm not going to even wish for it anymore i'm not going to waste my energy on it no don't be like that give it to god give it to the angels and then go about your business manifesting okay um yeah they don't want you to be a hermit anymore um you think you're protecting yourself by being a hermit, Pisces, and by maybe even some of you being alone, but you're not, do, you're not getting to what you want. You're not creating what you really want in your heart. Um, think about it. If somebody said, I'm going to give you what you really, really want, but it's only one thing, and you have to write it down within two minutes, what would it be? What would you have written down on the paper? Would it be a relationship that, um, you know, you broke up with or that is going sour or that the per other person has maybe addictions or you have addictions, something like that, or some kind of, um, there's some kind of issue or maybe they're attached to some another relationship or would it be, I, I really want a house, I really want to move, 
uh, I really want a new condo. Um, I want a jet ski. I just heard jet ski. <laughs> just jet ski in a boat, which is good for you, Pisces. You really need to be on a boat um, more often or a trip. Would it be a trip? Would it be um, your children's health? Would it be, uh, I just heard fortitude, fortitude, fortitude. What is fortitude? I'm sorry. When I get hungry, um, I get dumb. Okay. <laughs> Anyhow. Um, yeah. So the only thing that is real is friendship and love. Period. Amen. Oh, I like that. I wrote that. And this is all from a channeled energy reading that I did, you know, over a week ago. Okay, so they want you to know, don't be restless, don't be impatient, write down, act as if, okay, the only thing that real is real is friendship and love, period, amen. That's it, drop the mic, hey, drop this mic, okay, can you still hear me? I'm wondering, all right. Okay, so change is in your heart, Pisces. A fresh energy is around your birthday, March and April. I know some of you are saying, well, my birthday is not in April because that's Aries. Um, what I'm trying to say is the later ones, the present is coming, like some of you had a birthday. My brother's birthday was yesterday, right? Yes, uh, the 25th. So some of you might have had your birthday already, but what I'm trying to point out is that they're saying that March and April, uh, the end of March into April, you're going to start to see what you manifested. You're going to start to feel the gifts, the blessings. Okay. So they don't want you to stop praying for it. And look how I wrote the word show. Can you see that? Show with S with, is the money sign. I'm very clever, okay? <laughs> then show me the money. Okay, so you wanna, you're saying, then show me the money. Yes, from the universe. Money from the universe is coming in for you Pisces. Male and female, masculine and feminine, okay? The fish, okay. So it could be money. I just heard money from the state. It could be money. Some people's children get money from the state that a Pisces. It could be money from the state because you worked for the state and you forgot that you were supposed to file for some sort of money from the state. What else? Money from an inheritance. Money from, I didn't feel hot on inheritance, but I felt hot on money from the state. So check out if you had a state job or you worked for the state, there might be something that you didn't remember that